Hello, welcome to Gastrointestinal System Physiology MCQ series. This is a four part series. Here we are going to discuss in and out question and answers from this system. Now let's do not waste much time. Let's move to our first question. Monosaccharides are the product of digestion of what substance? Option A protein, option B carbohydrate, option C triglyceride, option D dipeptides. And the answer is option B barbohydrate. Now let's move to question number 2. The pH of saliva is option A less than 7, option B greater than 7, option C equal to 7, option D 0. And the answer is option A less than 7. Now let's move to question number 3. Which of the following is an enzyme? Option A amylase, option B gastrin, option C intrinsic factor, option C pepsinogen. And the answer is option A amylase. Now let's move to question number 4. Function in the liver include production of option A digestive enzyme, option B secondary bile acid, option C stereocobilinogen, option D turocolic acid. And the answer is Option D, Turocolic Acid. Now let's move to question number 5. During which phase of our gastric secretion stimulated by the sight and the smell of the food? Option A, Gastric. Option B, Digestic. Option C, Cephalic. Option D, Intestinal. And the answer is... Option C, Cephalic. Now let's move to question number 6. One of the functions of the liver is to produce Option A, blood cells. Option B, gastric enzyme. Option C, insulin and glucagon. Option D, glycogen from glucose. And the answer is... Option D, glucogen from glucose. Now let's move to question number 7. Which hormone stimulates the release of bile and pancreatic juice? Option A, cholecystokine. Option B, secretin. Option C, intestinal gastrin. Option D, pepsin. And the answer is... Option A, cholecystokine. Now let's move to question number 8. Name the major cell type in the liver lobule. Option A, Cooper cells. Option B, hepatocytes. Option C, sinusoids. Option D, epithelial cells. And the answer is... Option B, hepatocytes. Now let's move to question number 9. A lobule of the liver contains several blood vessels. Which one carries nutrient-rich blood from the small intestine? Option A, hepatic artery proper. Option B, hepatic portal vein. Option C, central vein. Option D, bile ductal. And the answer is... Option B, hepatic portal vein. Now let's move to question number 10. What does the bile do? Option A. Bile stimulates the release of lipase. Option B. Bile emulsifies fat. Option C. Bile digests fat. Option D. Bile hydrolyzes the fat. And the answer is... Option B. Bile emulsifies the fat. Now let's move to question number 11. What role do the Cooper cells of the liver perform? Option A, they are sinusoids. Option B, they are hepatocytes. Option C, they are macrophages. Option D, they deaminate amino acids. And the answer is... Option C, they are macrophages. Now let's move to question number 12. What is the name of the hormone that inhibits the stomach from secreting gastric juice? Option A, gastrin. Option B, pepsin. Option C, Endrogastrin, option D, cholecystokine. And the answer is option D, cholecystokine. Now let's move to question number 13. What role do the Cooper cells of the liver perform? Option A, they transport the plasma protein. Option B, they perform gluconeogenesis. Option C, they are macrophages. Option D, they produce bile. And the answer is Option C, they are macrophages. Now let's move to question number 14. To what does the term glyconeogenesis refers? 
option a the conversion of non carbohydrate molecule to glucose option b the formation of non essential amino acid from keto acid option c the removal of amine group from a molecule option d the release of glucose from stored glycogen and the answer is option a the conversion of non carbohydrate molecule to glucose now let's move to question number 15 What is the function of the bile? Option A, bile hydrolyzes the polypeptide. Option B, bile emulsifies the fat and oils. Option C, bile activates procarboxypeptidase. Option D, bile stimulates the pancreas to secrete pancreatic juice. And the answer is Option B, bile emulsifies the fat and oils. Now let's move to question number 16. Gaseous secretion is inhibited by option a calcium option b amino acids option c adrenaline option d calcitonin and the answer is option d calcitonin now let's move to question number 17 volume of saliva secreted daily is option a 500 ml option b 1000 ml option c 1500 ml option d 2000 ml and the answer is Option C, one thousand five hundred ml. Now let's move to question number eighteen. Volume of daily gastric secretion is option A, five hundred ml. Option B, two thousand five hundred ml. Option C, one thousand five hundred ml. Option D, two thousand ml. And the answer is option B, two thousand five hundred ml. Now let's move to question number nineteen. pH of stomach is. Option A one to two. Option B four to five. Option C seven to four. Option D eight to ten. And the answer is option A one to two. Now let's move to question number twenty. Which of the following causes increased gastric secretion by stimulating vagus nerve? Option A alcohol. Option B hypoglycemia. Option C caffeine. Option D all of the above. And the answer is. Option B hypoglycemia. Now let's move to question number twenty-one. pH of duodenum. Option A one to two. Option B four to five. Option C six to seven. Option D eight to nine. And the answer is option C six to seven. Now let's move to question number twenty-two. Volume of pancreatic juice produced daily is. Option A, five hundred mL. Option B, thousand mL. Option C, one thousand five hundred mL. Option D, two thousand mL. And the answer is option C, one thousand five hundred mL. Now let's move to question number twenty-three. Amount of bile secreted daily. Option A, five hundred mL. Option B, thousand mL. Option C, one thousand five hundred mL. Option D, two thousand mL. And the answer is. Option A, five hundred mL. Now let's move to question number twenty-four. Which of the following causes congested hyperbilirubinemia? Option A, hemolytic anemia. Option B, reduced bilirubin uptake into hepatocytes. Option C, reduced intracellular hepatic protein or binding to bilirubin. Option D, biliary obstruction. And the answer is. Option D, biliary obstruction. Now let's move to question number twenty-five. Amount of industrial secretion daily. Option A, five hundred mL. Option B, thousand mL. Option C, one thousand five hundred mL. Option D, two thousand mL. And the answer is option B, thousand mL. So thank you for watching this video. If you have any doubts, please mention below. We'll be back with part two of this series soon. So do subscribe to this channel. Bye.